Armed with lasers and high-definition cameras, this remote-controlled drone could change the way aircraft inspections are done. Any suspicious marks or damage are referred to engineers for them to check. The technique is being tested as an alternative to slower, fully manual inspections. Well, occasionally we get damage to the aircraft from atmospheric phenomena such as lightning strikes. They take many, many hours to cover an aircraft of this size, and we believe the drone and the drone technology can speed that up dramatically. The drones are currently operated by a pilot, but there are plans to make them computer controlled. This will make the inspections more methodical and easy to record for future reference. There's an awful lot of sectors that have a need to do inspection of quite complex, high value pieces of infrastructure, be they aircraft or bridges or chimneys or all sorts of things. Um, so I think the possibility for exploitation of drones for that task uh, is, is a really big opportunity. There's also growing interest in technology like these virtual reality glasses. They allow engineers, perhaps in another location, to see and possibly diagnose problems from a distance in real time. These things can get up close and personal with the aircraft on the ground. They can get uh, to those nooks and crannies, the bits and pieces of an airframe that perhaps uh, visual inspection might miss. So. Uh, for that reason, I'm all positive that, that this is a really good thing. The drones could be part of the official inspection of aircraft as early as next year. And if they are, then the airlines will need to ensure the new technique has the confidence of its passengers. Tarek Basley, Al Jazeera.